This is your boy Deontay Nelson. In today's video will be another YouTube news video. We have a bunch of news in today's video surrounding Jake Paul, Rice Gum, and a couple other big YouTubers. So make sure you stay and watch to the end of the video so you don't miss anything. Um, if you're new to the channel, hit that big red subscribe button underneath the video to subscribe to the channel to get daily news, pranks, challenge, and reaction videos. And uh, let's get straight into the video for today. First topic comes from Jake Paul. Jake Paul has a friend named Thomas Petru. And um, this guy is a really good friend of Jake Paul. He went to um, Texas with Jake Paul to um, help out with the um, Hurricane Harvey relief. And he's a really, really good friend of Jake Paul. And this guy, Thomas, was at the Team 10 house today. And he was ass basically assaulted by a pie thrown by uh, a member of A1 Pranks. So a member of A1 Pranks came to um, Jake Paul's house and hit this Thomas dude in the face with a pie. And then takes off running. And this Thomas guy, he, the way he reacts is so hilarious because in the video, he kind of just stands there and he's like, what the heck just happened? He looks around, guys just take off running. And um, he actually finds the guy with the camera, grabs the guy with the camera, grabs the camera from him and takes him back to the house and, and tells him to call his buddies. He's calling his buddies right here on the screen. And um, all his buddies come back and they all meet at, at uh, Jake Paul's house, and Jake Paul's dad gives him a lecture, and um, they take uh, the the A1 Pranks guy's SD card, and um, they destroy it, but they do give him his camera back, so we will never, so like, basically, they won't be able to post the vlog or the uh, video on YouTube. Into the next topic of today's video comes from Rice Gum and the Dolan Twins. Um, they're in a bit of drama right now because, if you don't remember, a couple days ago, the Dolan Twins went on on Casper's uh, podcast, and they exposed Jake Paul for saying that um, Jake Paul made the Dolan Twins. But in this video, they also talked about Rice Gum. They also talked some smack about Rice Gum, and Rice Gum made a video about it. And he said that um, he will most likely be uh, making a diss track on him. And uh, he just he, he watched the video. He watched what they said about him. Um, on Casper's podcast in this video, and um, we know Rice Gum, he gets tilted very easily. So, I mean, we could possibly see a diss track on the Dolan Twins from Rice Gum here soon, and that will be fire because uh, Rice Gum, all Rice Gum's diss tracks are pretty much fire. But let me know in the comments what y'all think about that. And into the last topic of today's video, this is the big one Net Nobody versus KSI. Is it finally over? I think it is finally over. Um, they both released their last diss tracks today. KSI released his diss track, and uh, Net Nobody released his diss track. And we're going to talk about those in a second. Um, but first, we're going to talk about KSI. KSI released his diss track first, and KSI's diss track was really, really good. Um, he really did diss um, Net Nobody really, really well. He said um, he talked about how Net Nobody well uh, was a uh, woman beater. He talked about how he pooped the sheets, and he thought it was a fart. He really didn't get on net nobody's case here, and um, it was just really, really funny because some of the things that he was saying were just really like crazy and exposing to um, at no at net nobody. And like, if these things are true, then this guy's a straight scumbag. But if they're not, then KSI is in some major, major trouble because he had um, um, net nobody's baby mama and ex girlfriend in the um in the uh, uh, music video and then after watching this net nobody responded with his own diss track and in this diss track he really didn't even diss case he kind of more or less thanked him um he was saying like how he was irrelevant and he had just retired from youtube and ksi helped bring his career back by getting in this diss battle and at the end of this this uh video he actually said that he he planned this whole thing out to make his girlfriend ex-girlfriend like de like defame his name and just talk so much trash about him so he could like use that as evidence that she shouldn't be able to keep his kid so he can get custody of the kid so basically Net Nobody literally just did all this drama just to prove that his girl ex girlfriend is childish and that she shouldn't be able to take care of the kid and that Net Nobody should get custody. So that is just unbelievable. If that is true, 
But thank you all for watching. Like, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Let me know what y'all think about this video in the comment section. Follow me on Twitter. Both of my Twitters are on your screen, my news Twitter and my personal Twitter. Feel free to um, DM me or uh, tweet me at any time. It's me, boy, Deontay Nails. I'm out. Peace.